Pamela Tadji, Executive and Artistic Director of Jacob's Pillow. And what you've just seen are some of the magical moments of dance on the stage of the historic Ted Sean Theater, the centerpiece of the Pillow Campus for nearly nine decades. I'm here today to share the exciting details of our Ted Sean Theater renovation, which we plan to open for Festival 2022, the 90th anniversary of the longest running and largest dance festival in the United States. In January, we broke ground for this renovation in the midst of a global pandemic. And I found myself thinking about the year the original theater foundation was poured, 1941, just as the United States entered World War II. And I thought about how the pillow has a long history of continuing on in spite of tragedy and adversity. On July 9th, 1942, the glorious Ted Sean Theater officially opened, the first performance space in America dedicated exclusively to dance. Today, our visitors still experience the theater much in the same way as those first audiences did, with enormous hand-hewn beams, knotty pine siding, and bare wood floors setting the tone. It would be impossible to list every history-making artist and company who has graced this stage. But from the very first season, when Ruth St. Dennis performed on stage with the back doors wide open, to Carmen de Lavalade commanding the same spot more than seven decades later, this theater has been a home for so many in the dance world. Now, in 2021, we find ourselves in a new chapter of the Pillows history. Theatrical technology has transformed, access and safety standards have advanced, and audiences expect more comfort than a theater built 78 years ago can provide. And so, three years ago, we began planning for the Sean's renovation. Most recently, the urgency of this project has become clear. The Ted Sean Theater in its current state simply cannot host artists, staff, and audiences safely in a post-COVID world. We must upgrade the ventilation system and add air conditioning in order to welcome performers and audiences in 2022. So let's take a moment together to envision a new Ted Sean Theater. Imagine a future August afternoon. It's hot, sunny, 90 degrees as you make your way to the theater, which looks much the same as it has always. But as you enter the theater, you notice a refreshing change. It's actually cooler than the air outside. As you take your seat, everything looks familiar. So what will be different? We'll have a new eco-friendly air conditioning and ventilation system, a new orchestra pit, which will be replaced with seats when it's not in use, enhanced accessibility out front and backstage, and an expanded stage size and an industry standard stage house. Here's another view of the theater as it is today. Some backstage elements are in serious need of an update to support a wide range of companies and to provide dancers with stronger services and facilities. The current outdoor dancer crossover will be upgraded and moved indoors. The roof height will be raised from 17 feet to 25 feet, allowing for more complex productions, rigging, and flying. A new backstage basement level will include dressing rooms, wardrobe spaces, an accessible ramp system, and will house the new sustainable and innovative ice-chilled cooling system. And here's the completed theater. The new stage house does not exceed the height of the cupola, maintaining the feel of this historic building and the Pillow Campus as a whole, while becoming a theater for today and tomorrow. One of the most thrilling possibilities that this renovation will make possible is the ability to welcome new companies from across the U.S. and the world whose work is too large or too complex to be accommodated now. Once these renovations are complete, the artistic possibilities become endless. As we look to the future while honoring our past, we hope you're as excited as we are about our plans and that you'll join with the Pillow family to support this project in any way that you can. We ask for your help in creating a rejuvenated theater for the dance community to enjoy for decades to come. Thank you.